Globalbodybuilding.com, North American. I'm here with the winner of the middleweight overhaul. What's your, what's your name? Where you from? Amy Sipsy. I'm from Middletown, Ohio. Whoa. How many shows have you done and how long have you been competing? Uh, I did my first show uh, March of 2004 when the uh, overall at the Cincinnati, then the overall at the Ohio, and then started competing nationally in 2005. She, she looked fantastic. She's all shredded, the whole thing. She's, um, she's also won the, um, what other class did you win? The, um, I got second in the Masters. I don't mean to put you on spot, but, you know, because I don't want to put you on spot, but you don't have to answer. How old are you? I am uh, 41 years old. Whoa, you look good, look fantastic. So what do you say to some of these people out here that bodybuild, that's, get, that's looking at bodybuilders like they don't want to get into it and they're sitting on their couch and they're 41, 42 years, 43 years old and they don't want to do nothing with themselves and thinking they can't do it. And here you are standing here at 41 years old and actually looking like got a body of a 22 year old. Uh, it's never too late. I uh, didn't start competing until in my late 30s. I have uh, two children, uh, been married for 15 years. So very supportive husband, very supportive family, which is, very, very helpful. And um, just you have to start one day at a time. Just get up and start every day, 30 minutes, and just take every day, one day at a time. What are your plans for the future? Well, we'll do something next year. Um, might go back and do the Masters and maybe try the USAs. Okay, cool. It's very, it's very nice. I mean, you, could, you have an email address for people to contact you out there because you have some fan base or something like that email address or any other thing else that you might want to talk about as far as a website, anything like that? Website, uh, amysipsy.com. have lots of good pictures there, so just check it out. Quincy Taylor, ProBodyBin.com, North American Championships 2009. I'm here with... Taylor Patrick. What's your name? Um, where are you from and how long have you been competing? Um, I'm from Lake Placid, New York. I've been competing for eight years nationally for three. What did you just win here? I won my pro card. I won open. She just became a new pro today at the show here. How, how long you been trying at this again? Um, I've been at the national level three years. What made you keep going? I want that pro card. I got that goal. How do you feel now that you've obtained it? Um, I'm still in shock because it's like I've been second and I've been first. I've, all, I've been really close, but I haven't quite gotten there. So I, again, I thought, well, I'm going to be the bridesmaid again. And, I got, I don't know what I'm, I haven't quite grasped okay, it yet, okay. yeah. So I'll take a couple days, talk to my trainer and see where we go. What are you gonna um, do as far as the future? Um, I've been struggling to keep a light weight. So from now on, I don't have to worry. I have always had to struggle to make weight. Now I can, you know, and make the improvements I need to without worrying about keeping my weight a certain way. So I, um, I'd like to get the improvements done I need to be done. Not a lot, just a few more pounds here and there. And that way I can, you know, come in the way I want to and not have to keep smaller. So, so that's a constraint. See, I never thought about that as far as the girls doing the bodybuilding. They got to really worry about their weight and keep the weight down. So if you get too big, you got to go up to the next class. Exactly. And I've been dominating the lightweight class since I started. So I've had to compete at under 115. So. I've been, it's been harder and harder each season for me to get weight. So I've had to really, you know, struggle to get there. So now I can, you know, stay full and not worry about weight because I'm always freaking out the last couple of weeks that I'm not going to make it. So now I can just relax and look what's happening in the mirror and not worry about the scale, which is a bodybuilder's worst nightmare, mm -hmm. as you know. Yeah, you're right about that. Looking at the scale, I stopped doing that about 10 years yeah. ago. Well, yeah, yeah, I don't have no choice. Yeah, I don't have no choice. Yeah. Um, what, um, Give me your um, email address, a website address, so people can contact you. Okay, um, I'm Tammy. Tammy at TammyPatno.com is my email. And um, my website is www.TammyPatno.com. I'm also on Facebook, just under Tammy Patno. Um, that's where I'm most active. My website needs to be updated, so I'll be doing that soon. So, Cool. Thank you very, very much. Well, thank and you, it's Quincy. great. And congratulations. Thank it's you. not that often you get a new pro. Yeah. Thank, thank you very, very much. Great talking to you. Quincy Taylor here, ProBodybuilding.com. I'm here with the overall winner for the female bodybuilding. Also, you won another class. What's your name? Where are you from? Um, my name is Zoe Lindsay, um, L-I-N-S-E-Y, and I'm a Canadian citizen, but I actually live in Okinawa, Japan. Wow. That's a long, that's a long travel there. Yeah, I've been traveling a lot. I did the Canadian Nationals last weekend, and then um, came down here just uh, spur of the moment and thought I'd just give it a try. Messed around, walked over with two, not one pro card, but two pro cards because she won the Masters. How old? I'm sorry for asking, but how old are you? It's okay. I'm 37. Wow, that's pretty good.
What, um, what made you get into bodybuilding? Well, actually, um, in my 20s, I struggled with eating disorders. And um, I was a classical violinist and uh, didn't do any athletics. But I um, really loved sports, so I started running marathons and uh, uphill and downhill racing. And uh, I just like extreme, the whole pushing myself to extreme levels. So I would buy all the magazines and see all the women. And I just decided that I would do my first show. And I got up on stage, and I was like, OK, no more partying. This is it. I, I, I'm, this is it. I'm hooked. So. You're, so you're a new pro. What classes did you exactly win? Um, I'm a heavyweight, and I weighed in at, at uh, 180. And uh, so I won the heavyweight class and the overall open and the master's heavyweight and the master's overall. That's the first time, isn't it? I think it's the first time ever. <laughs> I don't know. I just I'm in shock, you know. Yeah, yeah. When I when I saw her walk up backstage, I was like, oh wow, man, that's a big glass of water. She's damn near as tall as me, and she's got the build and the shape to go with it, and she's shredded. Thank you. That means what? a lot coming from you. <laughs> that's okay. Um, <laughs> okay, you're gonna make me blush. Stop it. Okay. Um, <laughs> I can turn purple. Okay. Um, what are your plans for the future? Um, well, I'm gonna go drink some water right now, and uh, that's the immediate future. And um, then I, I got to fly back to Washington t early tomorrow morning. Um, you know, I would I want to do a pro show. I mean, I became I mean, if I'm a, I, I've been dreaming about being a pro for a long time. I used to joke, well, I have to be pro 2025, but it's only 2009, so I got a couple years, I think, to you know get better. What a pro is a state of mind. Repeat it for me. Pro is a state of mind. My name is LaDon McDay, and I'm from Detroit, Michigan. Ooh, Detroit, okay. Was it a long trip for you here? No, it was only a couple of hours. Is this your first show time doing this national level show? No, I just finished up at the USA's in Vegas, um, light heavyweight, and I placed third in Vegas as well. Oh, you got two third places this year? Yes. That's not bad. At least you sit at the door with you. Next time around, they got the place you either hire or unless you come in looking a certain way, they're going to take care of you. What, um, what else you do besides this, and how did you get into this? Okay, well, besides this, I'm a full-time teacher. I teach third and fourth grade, so that keeps me very busy. So, And um, I've been competing for about three years now. It started off where I was kind of overweight, and I just kind of needed to go on a diet just for health reasons, and then I started seeing the weight drop off and decided that I wanted to, you know, take it a little further. How much weight you drop? Well, it wasn't like a tremendous amount, but I went from like a size 12, which I don't know if you know that for like the women's sizes, but just put it this way, I was really hippie, had a lot going on at the bottom, and I just wanted to kind of slender that down some. So maybe about 20, 30 pounds, but you know, like on a woman, that it was mostly body fat, so. How, you, how do those, um, how those kids treat you at your job? Oh, they love it. They love it. I don't have any behavior problems at all. I bet you don't. I don't. <laughs> you got any um, email address, anything like that for people to contact you out there? Um, yeah. Um, L-A-Y-D-A-Y-217 AOL dot com. Name, tell me your name, where you from, one more time. LaDawn McDay, and I'm from Detroit, Michigan. Thank you very much. Quincy Taylor here, probodybuilding.com. North American 2009. I'm here with the overall figure pro. Just got her pro card. What's your name and where are you from? My name is Silvana Silvati. I come from Toronto. Toronto? Toronto, I'm Canadian. Oh, you one of the second Toronto girls. We had one of the female bodybuilders come here and one got her pro card also. What made you get off into this whole figure thing and how long have you been competing? I've always wanted to. It's something I've always aspired to do. I can remember as a child looking at the Rachel McLeish and Corey Everson and just thinking, wow, they are like amazing women. And um, I started competing 10 months ago, actually. <laughs> um, my trainer just said to me, you know, they're looking for, you know, somebody that I think you'll kind of do well. They're not looking for a girl that's really, really big anymore. And give it a shot. And I've been doing well since, and here I am. <laughs> How many shows have you done? This is um, my fifth one this year. So just an under, yes, I've been working, I'm tired, and I'm looking forward to taking a break and um, maybe just going away somewhere all-inclusive. <laughs> take a good three months. Exactly, yeah. What, what do you plan on doing in the future as far as you got your pro card now? 
tell you the truth, I really haven't had much time to think about it. I don't even know. I'm just so new to this. This is just an experience in itself. I'm just going to enjoy this and uh, really think about what I want to do. But now I have options. And uh, I'm just, this is like a dream just yeah, to be but, pro. Um, what is it you can say to some of the women out here who are sitting on their couch, don't want to train, don't want to do nothing? I mean, here you are, you're sitting here, you said you did this in like 10, in what, 10, 10, 10 weeks? In 10 months. 10 I, months, yeah. you've been busting your butt. I haven't, but I've always worked out. I've always maintained in good shape. Um, just now, I just really incorporated a diet, and that's really what's missing in a lot of people's routines. They wonder why they don't change, and it really is just the diet. The muscle is there. If you work hard, don't be afraid to work out, women. Don't just stay on the ellipticals. Get in there, train hard. It's hard to get muscle, as you know. You know, it is. It is. So train hard and uh, eat clean. Congratulations, and you're, you're going to make a great pro. Thank you very, Thank you very, very much. much. ProBodyBeing.com, North American 2009. I'm here with Elizabeth Earhart. What you just got second in your class? I did. I just took second, and um, I had a great time. This is an awesome venue, and I'm looking forward to going to Team U in a couple of weeks. What class? What class did you take second in? I was in the figure E class and also in the over 35. You, you don't look over 35. I'm not going to tell my age. Never, lady never tells. <laughs> what, uh, what are your plans? You'll be planning on doing the Team Universe. Team universe. How, how'd you get into this? How'd you get into this whole bodybuilding thing? I started about two years ago in just the local Florida shows, and um, this past year I took the um, overall in Pittsburgh in the Masters, and I won my class in the Open, and I won Atlanta, and then I went to Junior Nationals, and I took first place in my class there. It's so really good. I'm on a roll. I'm on a roll. Maybe Team U will do it for me. Yes. But right now, I've got a limo waiting for me, and we're going to go out and have fun with my Team Bomb on Team Bombshell. So uh, the what? Bombshell girls are going to hit the town tonight. What's that Team Bombshell? Um, Shannon Day. It's a figure and bikini team. Yeah. How, can, how can people reach them to contact them to get some work? Bombshell.com. Bomb bombshellfitness.com. How can they contact you? What's your email address? Oh, Elizabeth at elliescorefitness.com. It's great meeting you. And do me one last favor. Give me a look into the camera and say, pro is a state of mind. Pro is a state of mind, baby. Thank you very much.